Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Dina. Thanks for joining me today. In this video, I will be repotting some peperomias in my collection. I have the baby rubber plant peperomia, the rana verde, and the watermelon peperomia. I will be repotting some plants into bigger pots and saying goodbye to terracotta pots. And I will also plant some cuttings I propagated in water into some potting medium. Peperomias were my favorite plants to collect when I started collecting house plants. They're small, compact, and perfect for plant shelves. But I found that some are easier to grow and propagate than others. And I like to have new plants growing in case I lose the mother plant for whatever reason. So I'm always propagating cuttings whenever I get the chance. First up is this Rana Verde Peperomia. This is not my original plant. This is from a cutting I propagated a while back, as well as this little plant here. I found the Rana Verde stem cuttings really easy to propagate in water. This plant though dries out really quickly in this terracotta pot. So as much as I love the terracotta look, they have to go. I will pot up both plants in one plastic pot and I will be using a mix of premium potting soil and perlite in this repot. Next up is the baby rubber plant Peperomia. Now this is the original plant I got from a couple of years back. I propagated a couple of leaves and stem cuttings in water. I left the cuttings in water for too long and forgot to pot them up. So they will probably take longer to acclimate in potting soil, but I'll take the risk and plant them together with the mother plant. And uh, the baby rubber plant Peperomia is another plant that is easy to propagate in water, both the leaves and stem cuttings. For this repot, I will be using a mix of premium potting soil and some perlite. This is the leaf cutting right there. I think I'll put up the cuttings around the mother plant. So that they're evenly around. That's the stem cutting there. Okay. I think these two merged. Uh, they stuck together, so I'll just cut them up there on the side. Okay. Right. Looks full. 
to put up is this beautiful variegated pepper romeo rooting in water and perlite for me water propagation is the best um, way to propagate pepper romeos if it is a variegated plant like this for example it is best to use stem cuttings uh, to propagate because it is more likely to carry over the variegated colors into the new plant i will put this up in a mix of cocoa peat and perlite I'm using this mix because it is low in organic matter. It is loose and fluffy so the small fragile roots can easily go through it. There's a lot of air movement to discourage rot and infections by using perlite. And um, with the cocoa peat, it retains moisture to encourage new roots to grow. And last to pot up are these watermelon pepper romia cuttings rooting in water. I will be putting them up in a mix of cocoa peat and perlite as well. I will try and handle these cuttings carefully so I don't damage the roots. that's it for today now these plants will have a lot of bright indirect light from where i will position them and uh, the potting medium will hold a bit more moisture as well now now that they are in plastic pots i have fewer plants in terracotta pots and i will move the rest into plastic pots soon and that is all for today thanks again for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and find it helpful please subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet leave a like comment hit the bell and i'll see you again in my next video